What's good, you guys? Pitman Scott here. I am back for episode number one of our Pokemon Diamond Let's Play on the channel. Um, I've actually just decided, literally right this second, you know what? We're gonna Nuzlocke this thing. I was gonna Let's Play it. We're gonna Nuzlocke it. <laughs> this is gonna go terribly, but let's do it. Alright, welcome to the Pokemon Diamond Nuzlocke Revival of the Hitmon community, guys. I am so excited to be back. This is going to be absolutely incredible. So if you were on Twitch the other night, you know we actually did episode one of Pokemon Diamond Let's Play already. That file, I have no clue where it went. It's on my computer. It won't let me access it for whatever reason. So we're going to start fresh and we're going to start things off right on the channel. Before we start, guys, please show some love that like button down below. Make sure to subscribe, join the Hitmon community, and get updated every time I upload. So if you guys can tell down below there in that so how can I, oh God, I can't point that direction. There we go. In that corner down there, there's a goal. That goal is for, I'm going to make, I'm going to make it a goal for myself to stream every video of this Pokemon Diamond Nuzlocke that we do. Now, if you guys come out and you get the notification, so make sure to follow me on Twitter. My link is down there and I will tweet out every time when I'm going live on Twitch. Now, when I go live on Twitch, the chat is going to show up right below me, so you guys can interact. I'm going to interact with you, so that's kind of like a personal thing we can interact with. And the goal is something that you guys get to um, kind of take effect with the Nuzlocke itself. So, for example, today's is, let me know in the chat who should be the next uh, team member in our party, basically. So, what's that's going to be kind of weird with our Nuzlocke rules. However, I think what I'm going to do with that is, up until the first gym, I'm only going to have two Pokemon. Third gym is going to be three Pokemon, fourth gym is four, fifth gym is five, sixth gym is six. That's tentatively what I'm saying, we'll see how that works. Um, so it's kind of like a limitation for myself. But I'm going to trade up until uh, one Pokemon. So if you guys are in the chat, you're going to let me know if you want that second Pokemon to be gone and switch it out for one of the uh, next Pokemon in my box. So obviously with a Nuzlocke, if you guys don't know, go for the rules very quick. Uh, first Pokemon on each route, that's the one you gotta catch. If you miss the catch, sorry, you're SOL. You don't get a capture for that route, so we're limited on the amount of Pokemon that we get. If your Pokemon faints, it dies, you have to release it. I don't believe in just putting it in a box. It is gone, release it, goodbye, it's gone forever. So we gotta go with that. Um, so basically, if I have like two or three Pokemon in the box, at the end of the episode, so that's where our goal comes in, you guys in the chat are going to decide who's going to be on our party. Are we getting rid of our starter? Are we keeping our starter? Are we getting rid of both Pokemon? So basically, you guys are going to decide my team going forward for the next episode. And then next episode, there's going to be a new goal in the chat, so it's not going to be the same thing every time, so I don't have to grind for like three hours. Uh, but you guys will get what I mean. So by the end of the episode, if there are people in the chat, you're going to decide who my team's gonna be for, for the next episode. And then we're gonna kind of build a lot from there. So, anyways, I've rambled for far too long, guys. Let's get into this. Um, so I kinda know what we're doing. I wanna keep the episodes about 25-ish minutes, 20, 25 minutes, give or take. Um, so we'll see how that goes, but we'll look for like a natural stopping point in the story. Uh, if you guys don't know, Gen 4 is, excuse me, ooh, hiccuping, or burping, I guess. Um, Gen 4 is very special to me. I actually, when I was younger, my dog Chelsea, our family dog, she passed away. We had to have her put down. She was very, um, she got very sick. She was a great, great dog. We loved her so, so much. And we had to have her put down. And the next day, I found out the next Pokemon game was getting released in a week. And that was something that I, I had to look forward to, which I thought was really cool. I tried to go past this guy twice. Like, I wasn't even reading anything. He's like, no, dude, you gotta go talk to Devin, <laughs> who's, if you guys don't know, Devin's my best friend, he's the best friend in the world, he's my brother. Uh, so I always name my rivals after him. So Devin's here. If you see a lot of black spots, that's not on you. I think that goes way after the first town, from what I noticed. That's just the emulator running. So anyway, that's what it is. Um, yeah, so I got Pokemon Diamond a week after we had to put our dog down. I think like eight days after. And um, it, it kind of helped get me through. It's a bit of a distraction in a sense. And I miss Chelsea a lot. I still do. She was such an amazing dog. Um, yeah, but anyway, yeah, now my dog's getting jealous. I can hear her scratching around next door. Um, yeah, so this game kind of helped me get through that, and I, I really enjoyed it. It was a great game, and I haven't really played Gen 4 too, too much. I played through Diamond, I played through Platinum once, and I started replaying through Platinum last year, and it was a really fun time, but I didn't finish the game yet. I still have it on my DS, I'm actively working through it little, little by little. It's not going too, too fast, but that's okay. 
Anyway, so I'm really excited to play through Gen 4 again. Um, on my last laptop that I had, where I was doing videos before this kind of revival of the Hitmon community, um, that's kind of what I'm dubbing these, these next few months, end of the year, is revival of the Hitmon community. And you guys will see a lot of trend with the, the upcoming videos. Um, and there'll be a lot of input from you guys. I want your input on kind of how the channel is looking, how it's running, um, how the layouts look, how the music sounds. I'm really looking for a lot of input from you guys. I'd really appreciate it. Come on out to the live streams, check it out. Let me know what you like, what you don't like. Uh, we'll help build this channel together into kind of the vision that I have for it. And I'm really excited to start the new year as well. Um, yeah, anyway, so there's a lot of incentive for you guys to come by in the, uh, in the chat and the stream and, and come check me out live. All right, so. Let's move out. We're going to show Devin here up to, uh, I can't remember the lake's called. This is the, I think this is the one where, uh, is it Vesper shows up or Azov, one of the two? I can't remember. It's one of the three lake guardians. I can't remember what they're called. Mm. All right. Oh, my dog's already whining and barking. Oh, no, it's going to be so great. <laughs> That's okay. All right, so let's go up here. We're going to see Professor Rowan, who I couldn't remember his name for the life of me in the last episode, or when I was streaming there the other night. But uh, yes, yeah, so Professor Rowan and Don, we're going to meet up with them. We're going to steal a couple of Pokemon, so because we're just stand-up citizens that way, and that's okay. Hmm, I may have been mistaken. Something appears to be different than it was before, but fine. It's enough that we've seen the link. Don, we're leaving. Alright, so this is one thing I brought up in the, in the Twitch stream the other night, that I want your guys' opinion on down in the chat, or in the uh, comments below on YouTube. Professor Rowan, okay, so here's a little bit. Professor Oak. He studied Pokemon his whole life, right? So that, that was his thing. And that's cool. And he gave us blank Pokedex, Pokedexes, and it wasn't that his was blank, it's ours were blank. So we had to adventure for ourselves, but he already knew. So that's fine. But Professor Rowan, did he just move to Sinnoh? Or has he always been the professor here? Because if he lives just out next door, I think in Sanjum Town or whatever it's called, and he's never been to this lake that's literally like a 30 second walk over, why is that? Why has he never visited the lake? Anyway, I don't know if he's scared of water, that's why he had Dawn there with him or, or what, but he's never been to this lake before. So he's like, oh no, we've, we've seen this lake, this is what it is, that's great. And uh, yeah, and then he was scared enough where he forgot his briefcase. I think, here's the theory, let me know what you think in the comments down below. Question of the day, is Professor Rowan scared of water? So, that's that's what I think is going on here. Uh, that's why he's never been to the lake, he had to have an escort, he forgot his bag out of anxiousness. I, I think he just forgot. Even when he's going back to the lake, he isn't just like coming by himself to pick up his bag, like only up to his mistake. He is like, okay, no, I need to have Don come with me to make sure I don't like fall in the water or anything like that. I think he just can't swim. Maybe that's what it is. Um, so as for our starters here, if you guys were in the chat, I'd ask for questions. There's nobody here today. That's okay. I know it's kind of late. Um, I usually go with Piplup, and I did when we did our um, little trial the other night. But you know what? I think, I think, I'm going to go with Jimcha. I'm going with Chimchar. Let's go with Chimchar. I don't think I've ever used Chimchar and played through Pokemon Diamond in my life. So this is going to be really interesting. All right. So first of all, encounter kind of Starly. Thank God it's not a shiny. That would have been the absolute most heartbreaking thing in the entire world. All right. So we got Scratch and Leer. Um, yeah, our Piplop actually in, in the chat the other week was uh, was modest. I was really excited about that. So I'm really hoping for an adamant Chimchar. Um, so Adamant obviously is the best thing we can possibly get uh, with like Mach Punch, Close Combat, stuff like that, Fire Punch. But anything that doesn't have a lower attack, uh, so as long as we're not like modest, I'll, I'll be happy. <laughs> but we'll see. Alright, also let me know, uh, volume wise, is my voice okay? Is the music in the background okay? I, I think it's alright. I did a quick test beforehand, I think it's okay, but just let me know. As for um, upload schedules, I'm not sure exactly what it's going to look like. I think I'm going to come up with an update video. Today's Tuesday, probably Friday. I'm going to come up with an upload up, update video, you guys. Just let you know kind of what my plans are for the channel, schedule-wise. Um, if you guys have been around my channel forever, you, you know I have no consistent schedule, and I want that to change. Um, so if you follow me on my Twitter, I was supposed to actually record this episode last night. However, I ended up kind of spur of the moment, restarting Taekwondo, which is awesome. I just played Taekwondo for like 14 years. It was a huge, huge part of my life. I got my fourth three black belt uh, last August when I was actually moving up to Edmonton. On the way up, I stopped through Ontario, tested my fourth degree with our grandmaster, and then finished the trip up to Edmonton. Yeah, see, he even sent Don. He sent Don to pick up the suitcase instead of him going back himself and getting it. I know like he's old, so maybe that's it, but I still think there's something going on with this he can't swim theory. All right. Yeah, I think, because I'm pretty sure Professor Rowe is actually just waiting just outside here on Room uh, 201. If that's the case, why didn't he just come with Don? 
why didn't he get the suitcase? Hashtag Professor Rome can't swim, make it trend on Twitter. Alright. Uh, yeah, so Devin's like, I know we can't steal these Pokemon, man. I'm just a little bit longer with it. Uh, yeah, so that, that's okay. So let's see here. I'm pretty sure Professor Rome is like right here, isn't he? Uh, yeah, he is. Uh, yeah, see, so he was right there, but he still, he was like, no, I can't go to look. I just, I can't do it. So, oh, well, that's so funny. That's just a revelation. It's great. Uh, anyway, yeah, so I started playing with Noah again. I went to get back again tonight, and it's, uh, it was so much fun. It was very, very exciting. It was a great workout. I, I forgot how much I missed it, to be honest, guys. It was such a big part of my life for, for a majority of my life, and I stopped for a year, and was like, yeah, I want to get back into it at some point. And, uh, yeah, no, it's been a good time. So I'm really looking forward to, to training up again. And my ultimate goal, obviously, a uh, lifelong goal of mine, is I've wanted to get selected for Team Canada to play the World Championships, which the next ones are in Finland, actually, in 2021. So I have two years to get back in shape. i got to lose about 15 to 18 pounds, get back in shape, get my flexibility back up to where it was. I used to be able to do splits, can't anymore. So i got to work on that. All right, so let's go home and, uh, and see her mom here. I think she can give us the running shoes again. All right. And we don't have balls yet. So the Nuzlocke, if you guys, if you don't know, the uh, Nuzlocke does not start until we get Pokeballs and we can actually catch Pokemon. So it doesn't happen until Route 202 when Dawn gives us to it, uh, gives five Pokeballs to us after she shows us how to catch Pokemon. So we're going to go through Route 201 here. That does not count as our first encounter. So I think what I'm going to do for the episode is uh, I'm going to try to get an encounter on Route 201 and 202. That'll give us three Pokemon. Hey, Kirby right back at you. Hey, man, what's going on? Oh, I just realized it says I'm streaming Kirby. Oh, my gosh. Oh, we have a lot of people coming in the chat. How are you guys doing tonight? I probably said I'm streaming Kirby right now, but it's actually Pokemon Diamond, so hopefully you guys like Pokemon. I forgot to change the Switch notification thing. That's all right. All right, so we've got the running shoes. I'm going to go to Route uh, 201 and 202 here, uh, try to get some Pokeballs and catch some Pokemon for our Nuzlocke. Alright, apparently I'm wearing shoes, trailing your adventure. Um, no, I took the game by accident. Gosh, darn, that's okay. What are you guys up to tonight? Alright, let's go. Let's go. Oh, you've been you've been that good, eh? Awesome. Alright, so let's try to champ our chimchar just just a little bit here so we don't get absolutely bodied. Uh, Bidoof. Bidoof's great. I, I would actually not be upset with the Bidoof on our team. Uh, he's a great HM slave. Bidoof is just a meme in itself, so it's just great. Ah, oh, I didn't check the nature of our gym chart. I gotta do that this episode. After this uh, battle. So, if you guys enjoy Pokemon, and you know kind of what's going on, I'm doing a Nuzlocke right now. Uh, so basically what's gonna happen, I'm gonna have two more Pokemon. Uh, here, following our fellow Kirby streamer. Nice, nice, nice. Yeah, I'm going to stream uh, Kirby tomorrow night, I believe. Uh, I'm doing Nightmare in Dreamland. I'm just a quick playthrough of it. I'm a complete amateur, so we'll see how that goes. But uh, yeah, if you guys play Pokemon at all, you know what's going on. I'm playing a Nuzlocke. Uh, I'm going to catch two more Pokemon, and you're going to pick one of them to put on my team. So we'll see what two Pokemon I get. All right, it's a bit of goes down. Not too much trouble with our gym chair. What Kirby game are you guys playing? Were you streaming or watching a stream, or, or what was going on? Yeah, I was uh, playing Kirby the other day, and it was, it was a great time. I haven't played Kirby in a while, so it's a lot of fun. I think it's such an underrated game in general. Kirby's just so cool. <laughs> All right, another Bidoof. That's okay. Ah, I forgot to check the nature again. Oh my gosh, wow, I'm forgetful. All right. That's okay. All right, let's level up here. I think two to three hits should take this Bidoof out. Hopefully two. Oh, it should be Kirby anime right now. Is this Kirby anime? That's an old one, right? I'm pretty sure there's like an old Kirby show, or is there a new one? If there's a new one, I gotta check this out. Alright, one, one more hit from two that it should be able to, to take it out. Oh no, maybe two, alright. Maybe we're not out of an age. <laughs> oh, that'd just be awful. Uh, fun fact, Kirby is cute. Kirby is very cute. He is the absolute cutest thing. He's just a small pink ball of adorableness. <laughs> it's absolutely awesome. All right, so Bidoof goes down. Chimchar is going to level up here to level 26. Or, oh my god, level 26. Wow, I don't know where that came from. Chimchar is going to level 6. Magic is level 26 under 201. Oh my god. That would take forever to grind out. All right. Hopefully we can through them in the battle. Yeah, there we go. Oh, okay, let's check his nature. Uh, so let me know in the chat. Oops, why is that not... Oh, right, because I have to click. There we go. Uh, let's see it. Um, that's fine. Okay. All right, let me know in the chat. Uh, I'm sure Kirby right back at you. Nice. Alright, so let's check out what nature is going to be. Let me know in the chat what do you think it's going to be. Or put it in the comments below what do you think our chimchar is going to be for nature. I'm hoping for adamant. 
Um, as long as it's not like modest or bold or calm or something like that, I think it'd be okay. Let's do it. It's brave. I don't know what brave nature is. <laughs> Literally not a clue. I'm gonna Google it right now. What is brave nature? Uh, brave nature Pokemon. What does brave do? Uh, let's do... Brave is increase attack, decrease speed. Oh, there we go. I'm totally fine with that. Brave, there we go. All right, so increase attack, decrease speed. That's, I'm oh, fine with that. Chimchar is fairly fast to begin with, so that's fine. But as long as we got an increased attack stat, this is gonna be a great start to the Nuzlocke. All right, so here's Don. She's gonna show us the professor. We gotta talk to him for a minute. And then uh, we have to go back to talk to her mom. And then we have to go talk to Don again. And then we get our Pokeballs. So we got a little bit left to go here in this episode, but that's okay. So we're gonna get our two catches, hopefully knock on wood. And then that'll call for this episode. That'll give me time to figure out what, um, basically what Pokemon we're gonna have on the team, train up those two, because if you missed the start of the episode or if you forgot, I'm only gonna have two Pokemon up until the first gym later. Um, so I gotta kinda gotta figure out between the two catches that I get. I really want Shanks. I think Shanks would be absolutely awesome for our team. Uh, we have huge ground weakness, uh, which kinda sucks, because the first gym leader's rock, so it wouldn't be the best thing in the world. But I don't really think there's much we can do with Chimchar. So I definitely need to grind up a little bit. Um, I'm pretty sure his ace of Cranido is level 14, so I'd like to have at least level 15 going in. Um, oh, if I could get Monferno with a fighting type move, it would be just fantastic. Uh, all right, so what are we going to name Chimchar? Uh, uh, Chimchar is like a monkey. He's a fire monkey. You know, let's name him uh, Cheeto. I don't know why. So let's go with Cheeto. C H E E T O. Cheeto. I think it's nice to be Cheeto, right? Sure, why not? Let's go with that. Alright, so you're happy with that nickname? Yeah, let's go with Cheeto. Cheeto the gym chair. Ah, alliteration. Alliteration is awesome. Alright, so let's go through. I'm not one, one big reading text, or if you guys want to, you can slow down the video and read it for yourself. I, I'm not great with impressions. I'll try to work on it to get better, but let's be honest, you guys don't li like listening to me talk normally, so. Tell voice acting is uh, it's not my forte. Alright, so he wants me to fill up the Pokedex. His name is Rowan. That's fine. Typical Pokemon adventure. Alright, so he wants to trust us with the Pokedex. Will I record the data? Sure, why not? I I've tried to say no before. He just, he's like, are you sure? I'm like, no. He's like, are you sure? And I'm like, no. And he's like, are you sure? And I'm like, no. And, and you see where that goes. So I eventually just have to say yes. So okay, I'll go on with Pokemon Adventure. Alright. I'm digging this music, it's, I don't know, it's very subtle, it's nice, it's not bad, so I'm happy with that. Alright, did you do, oh come on, let's go, let's just go catch Pokemon. Alright, Pokemon I used for the first time was Turtwig, if you had chosen Turtwig Lake, we'd have the same Pokemon now. I don't think that's how that works, she's, she's a liar, so. Alright, right, so let's go back and uh, see our mom. Also, oh yeah, I forgot we could run inside, that's great. Alright. Lactic your mentor, we've got a bit more experience, blah, 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 blah. follow me. Ugh. I actually just got back from Taekwondo like 10 minutes before recording this, so I'm feeling a little sore. I probably stretched before bed, didn't do much of that, so yeah. Alright, so we got the Pokemon Center, we got the Pokemon, just kind of standard stuff. I, it still bugs me that they make you, they force you into this tutorial every single Pokemon game. They show you to catch a Pokemon, they show you the first town. It's like, I think there should be a choice at this point. You know, we're almost eight generations in now, they they should make that an option. But anyway. Alright, so before you go to the Pokemon Center, yeah, so I should definitely heal up. Even though Nuzlocke hasn't started yet, um, I've been out of the Nuzlocke mindset for a long, long time. So we'll heal up here, just get in the habit of keeping everyone nice and fresh and healthy. And then we're back to your mom, get our two encounters, and uh, we'll call that an episode. I think that should be a good natural stopping point. And then next episode, we'll go to Jubilife City, we will get our Poketch, and then we'll go take down the first leader. So that's kind of what I have planned. <laughs> Hopefully it's good. I have never, if you guys know you've been on the channel forever, I have never once completed Nuzlocke. It's never gone longer than like six episodes. So I'm really hoping that this is this will be the one that we actually get to play through the whole story. Um, but yeah, so we'll see. All right, let's just avoid the battles for now. Chimchar's level six. That should be okay. Um, yeah, just just to catch our Pokemon, and then obviously I'll go and I'll grind up a little bit off screen just to 
Make sure we're not going to get absolutely bodied. Um, <laughs> Crying after episode one, jeez. Um, you can tell how scared I am already. Alright, uh, take this rest here, that's fine. Heal us up, thank you very much. Not that we needed it. Alright, so mom's a little worried. She's like, ah, oh, you're going off, but you know what? You're going to do great. She believes in us and gives me a journal to record all of our epic adventures. Alright, so journal keeps record of your daily events. Check it and you'll be able to remember what you did last. Cool, I'm down with that. Plus, you're not only a Pokemon with you. Darn right, dude. We have Cheeto. Cheeto is absolutely phenomenal. Alright. Myself, so you go enjoy your adventure. When you're exposed to new things and new experiences, da, 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 just let us go. Please and thank you. Alright, his mom comes in. Uh, it's Devin. Oh, yeah, she's. Yeah. <sighs> I just want to go on our Pokemon adventure. Guys, we're 10 years old. We have our first Pokemon. Just let us go. That's one thing I love about Pokemon Red. There was no, like, exposition, there was no backstory. It was literally just play through the game with yourself. Be the hero, play the story. There, there was none of this, like, go talk to your mom type stuff, which I love my mom. My mom watched my videos. Mom, I love you so much. You are, you're the whole reason I'm here today. <laughs> Literally and figuratively. So, yeah, so thank you for all your love and support. I couldn't be doing it without you. But, yeah, in, in these games, it just, it drags out so long with the intros. Once you get going, everything's picked up pretty quick, especially in, in Diamond. Uh, the storyline is absolutely incredible. So, Let's hope we don't get too many battles here. Uh, first pass of grass, success. Let's go. That's okay. Yeah, we will take down this probably good dude. Oh, it's a Starlink. Nice. Once again, not a shiny, thankfully. All right, let's go Cheeto. I love that name, actually. I'm really happy with that. That's cool. All right. Let's uh, just scratch. He's level three, so this should be a good amount of experience with the Starlink, hopefully. Uh, two shot? Nah, three. That's good. Cheeto use Scratch. Scratch again. Oh, that, that was a really, I, that was a low roll. Actually, it's probably a low roll and the first one was a high roll. That did nothing. Unless he was, he was growling us. He was growling us, guys. <laughs> I'm so tired. Oh, man. I can't think today. Alright, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Uh, oh, he gets the crit. Alright. Alright, so the Scratch should take him out, though. No problem. So that's always good. Also, let me know in the comments down below, guys. Um, is there a controller I can get to play these kind of games on my PC? Because right now I'm using my keyboard, obviously you can probably hear. I don't like the clicking sound of the keyboard. Um, so if there's a controller I can get, please let me know, or if there's a way I can set one up. Uh, whether my Xbox One controller or my Switch controller would be great. I love the Pro controller. Um, yeah, so definitely let me know, because I would love to set that up for these uh, these Pokemon Let's Plays. It would just be so much easier to play. Oh, let's just have our Pokemon. I think it only took a couple of hits, but that's okay. All right, thank you for waiting. Start Pokemon full health, and we hope to see you. All right, I always do the double click. Always do the double click. F in the comments for the double click, guys. We all do it. You know you do it. If you say you don't, you're a liar. All right, so Don's gonna teach us how to catch Pokemon. Give us five Pokeballs, and we're gonna get our first two encounters of the Nuzlocke. Hopefully, it all goes well. If it's a shiny, I mean, that's just a bonus. Obviously, shiny claws is in the effect, by the way. If I find a random shiny, you know I'm gonna catch it. Watch her get a shiny encounter here. I would absolutely die. No, all right, thank God. <laughs> all right, she so gets a little too bidoof. She's gonna throw her turf break and do a bit of damage here. Oh man! All right, come on, Don. You can hurry up. It's okay. It's okay. Come on, Don. Come on. It's okay. Let's. Go. Wow, that was a strong hit for the turret. Matt must be adamant or something. Jeez, got the positive attack stats going. All right, the eight speeds down. Three for a Pokeball. Um, I think it'd just be so funny. She just had like a red Master Ball or something, and <laughs> just this like new trainer was like, "Yeah, Master Ball and a Bidoof." It'd just be the absolute funniest thing in the world. <laughs> All right, so gonna throw that out. Come on, Don. Let's go. Oh. And she catches a bit too. Uh, is it possible for, for her to fail that uh, that catch? I don't know. I'm, I'm pretty sure they're like older gens that can fail the capture, but I don't know about this one. I think they kind of corrected it in the DS era, so. Alright, so I got their HP as low as possible. Understandable, that's fine. Alright, so you started giving five of balls. Alright. So we're gonna head to route 201 first. 
Uh, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to save the lake for later when we can go fishing. And then I'm going to fly back and do the lake there. Just so we can get a bit of a higher catch. So I'm going to get two Pokemon this episode. Let's go to Route 201 first and uh, go from there. I'll, I'll save all the fishing for, for once. All right, so comments down below. Who's our first encounter going to be? Is it going to be a Starly? Is it going to be a Bidoof? I'm kind of hoping for a Bidoof, not going to lie. But a Starly with Intimidate would be... Not with Intimidate, sorry. A Starly in general would just be great. Star Raptor is Intimidate. All right, what's it going to be? Shiny? That's Starly. That's all right. I'm cool with that. I'm absolutely fine with Starly. All right, so level two. So I think I should only attack it once. I don't really want to risk a crit and lose an encounter on Brute 201. So we'll give it a go. Scratch. Okay, yeah, they're definitely just one hit. Definitely, definitely one hit. I don't care if he's growling us, we would knock that thing out. It's knowing me I'd crit it, would die, and I'd cry, and everything would be awful. <laughs> Alright, so let's go here, throw our first Pokeball. Hopefully we don't run out of balls on the first first catch. Alright, let's just get it. One throw and go. Come on guys, let's go. One, two, three, hey, there it is. Alright, so we got the Starly in the bag, which is always awesome. Level two, he's a male. Alright, whatever you name the Starly now, that's always the hardest thing, it's always good names. Starly, Staravia, Star Raptor, he's a bird, he's a birdie. Um, let's name him Shuttle. After, I don't know. Uh, after like Babington, the birdie, let's name him, let's name him Shuttle. Alright. S H U T C L E, Shuttle. Alright, cool, I'm down with that. So we got Cheeto and we got Shuttle. Now, obviously, I'm not sure if Shuttle is going to stay on the team or not. Um, we're gonna find what this next encounter is gonna be. And four Pokeball should be enough. I'm not gonna waste more money yet. Alright, come on, who's gonna be? So I think we have a chance for a Shinx, uh, Starly, and Bidoof for the three. I love a Shinx. Give me a Shinx from Intimidate, please. Ah, it's a Bidoof. That's okay. That's alright. I said I wouldn't be upset with a Bidoof. Bidoof's great. I'll take it. Alright. So, let me know in the comments down below uh, who should our team be? Should it be. Like, we have Cheeto. We have uh, Shuttle, and we're going to hopefully get this uh, Bidoof here, who's yet to be named. Let me know what two Pokemon we're going to take into the first gym. Um, I'd really like to keep... I mean, we're going to have a big, big weakness to this this Rock gym, so... i got to do a lot of grinding here and get a, try to get the best moves that I can, because it's going to be a little little tough, I think. Alright, so let's throw a ball after this, uh, this guy tackles us up. Alright, bag. Pokeball, yes. That's true. Hopefully this thing just takes one catch. I don't really want to spend a lot of a lot of time balls on this thing. It's just a bit of... But he'll be good, but I can learn like Surf and Waterfall and that kind of stuff. He, he's a great HM slave, so it'll go well. And, and Bibroll is kind of bad, so it's good. You know, he's tanky. Alright, so we got the Bidoof. What are we going to name this thing? Um, Bidoof, Bibroll. He's got a beard. Um, uh, he's got buck teeth. He's a beaver. Um... You know, he's a beaver, I'm Canadian. Let's name this thing... Oh, Canada. Oh, Canada. Alright. So we got Oh, Canada. We got Shuttle. And we got... Oops. Um, Cheeto. So those are our three team members right now. So let me know in the comments down below, guys. Who is our team going to be? What team members are going to have? I'd recommend, please let me keep Cheeto. Uh, Cheeto's kind of going to carry us for a little bit. <laughs> but uh, yeah, let me know in the comments down below what you want to see for our team. Uh, the next episode will probably go up sometime this weekend, I believe. Probably Saturday will come up. Hopefully this will go up on Wednesday, so hopefully Saturday that um, I'll have that episode. So it gives you guys a couple days to kind of let me know what the team's going to be, so I have time to grind up. But if you enjoyed, please don't love that like button down below. And make sure there's comments, so let me know what the team member's going to be. And click that subscribe, subscribe button so you can join the Hitmon community, guys. Alright, thank you so much for coming out. If you enjoyed, keep it kicking, guys. Simple Scott, peace out.